Hey guys, Sith Lord 310 here with a new video, my re movie review for All Eyes on Me, the Tupac Shakur biopic. I, I guess you could call it a biopic. Okay, this movie, I f at first I thought it was, was like was going to be connected from the um, Straight Outta Compton, but it actually isn't. I mean, in a way it is, but this movie is pretty much just trying to be what Straight Outta Compton was, a great biopic about one of the most famous and influential musical groups you know, of all time. But this movie did not hit that mark at, at all for me. This movie tried really hard of being, of, it tried to really keep it in your face that this is a biopic. Keep in mind this is a biopic. I mean, without getting into specifics or spoilers, I mean, this is based on a true story. So everything that I, you know, if I mention something from the actual plot of the movie, it's not spoiling anything because it's a real life event. But this movie, it tries really hard to try to be what Shadow Compton was, and it really doesn't hit the mark. It tries, you can tell it's trying really hard to be serious and to, and to really make you care about this character, but there's just a lot of things in this movie that don't work. Demetrius, the main actor, Demetrius, he does okay as the main, as a main character. He's not the worst thing about this movie it's definitely not the problem he portrays Tupac really well and he looks like Tupac which you can believe this is his son and but the biggest problem with the movie like I said before is that it tries it just feels like a bio like a biography it doesn't feel like an actual story it's just it's hard to say it's hard to really prove my point but what I'm trying to say is that you know with a movie like this a a biopic, you know, it's in the genre of biopics. It should try to be a movie, try to have stories, try to have make you feel like you're actually there with the character, like this character is an actual person and not just this legend or this, you know, this written character. Make sure, you know, you want to feel like this is an actual person. And in the movie, you don't feel like this, like you don't feel like you're there with the person. You feel like you're just reading a book about him. You don't feel like you're actually going through what this character is going, you don't care about the character, and this movie isn't gonna, you know, bring in any new fans of Tupac, it isn't, and it, but it, you know, but it's also not gonna really, I don't think it's gonna please the hardcore fans of Tupac, actually, this movie's a big, you know, it's an underwhelming movie, the trailers did not really sell this movie to me, I wasn't really interested in, I saw the movie because, you know, I really enjoyed Straight Outta Compton, and I, you know, love Tupac music, but this, you know, I was hoping this movie would be good and really represent the story and the legend of Tupac really well, and it just didn't do that. It just felt bland. It felt like a, it felt, it just didn't feel cohesive. It didn't, nothing felt like it fit in the movie. Everyone felt like they were playing a character, and I don't want that. I want the character, the actors, the characters in the movie felt like they were characters. They didn't feel like they were actual people. I didn't have actual emotional, you know, weight or gravitas to these characters i didn't care about them so in the end with everything that does happen at the end i won't give it away but if you don't know you're really in for a surprise i guess um you know i didn't care this movie was very underwhelming there are some good things like i said about this movie demetrius he play he does an amazing job as playing tupac he really embodies the character and he really embodies the physique of Tupac, and this movie incorporates, just like Straight Outta Compton, and, um, I forgot the name of the movie, but the, the Notorious B.I.G. movie, um, they really incorporate the music of the artist really well into the, into the movie. Never feels like, oh, look, you know this song? I'm gonna put it right here in this scene that doesn't make sense. It always makes sense, and that's my, that's some good things about the movie. The movie the acting overall isn't bad in the movie, it's just the fact that the characters are written as characters, they're not written as people. They just feel so lifeless and bland and really robotic. But yeah guys, I'm gonna give All Eyes on, All Eyes on Me a 6 out of 10. This movie was very underwhelming to me, and like I said before, it felt like a, I was reading a biography, it didn't feel like I was watching a story with a human being. So yeah guys, what did you guys think of All Eyes on Me? Make sure you guys comment below and let me know. And as always, if you guys enjoyed, make sure you guys like and subscribe. And as always, may the force be with you.